How are you doing folks? It's Joe Value here for Cold Bear Sports on Thursday evening with two selections for tomorrow and two uh, horses which I'd say you know very good chances it just uh, depends if to get the, the look at the right time but uh, I expect them to be bang there and I also have one for the Patriot service that uh, you know hopefully does the business as well uh, nice to get the winner on the Patriot service today Paddy fancied one really strongly uh, Pretty much a max bet, I think it was. And I uh, got it done, never really a doubt um, from the minute the stalls open. So, yeah, nice one to win like that. Uh, so, moving on to my two for my YouTube uh, for tomorrow. We start off in the 6.30 at Dundalk, horse by the name of uh, Gualinia. I know I thought I was going to have this as a service bet, but uh, she's too short at 11 to 10 because there is one horse in it that I'm a little bit afraid of. James Nash has a horse. That's pretty unexposed. Now, on form, you'd expect Harrington's my selection uh, to beat that. But, you know, when a horse coming back from a break, uh, they can just uh, be a different type of horse. So, for that reason and for the reason, the price it is, I'm just going to uh, put it up on uh, the, my YouTube channel. So, um, yeah, so it's uh, Guilliana's 11 to 10, uh, placed in a group three, actually, uh, last year. But... Uh, you know, she's been very hit and miss since, I suppose. Did show a fair bit last time in a fair race around Dundalk and has, you know, has had plenty of chances, definitely, but I still think has less to prove on the form book uh, than the rest of her rivals tomorrow. Uh, Tom Madden rides. I'm sure Jessica Harrington will be really anxious to get a race out of this one, so, you know, it'd be important for her page, breeding-wise, you know, if get the job done tomorrow now and... Uh, that'll probably be it for her. Don't really see a future for her in, in handicaps. You know, you wouldn't be doing, uh, you can't do any more than just win your race and be placed in the group three. And then obviously uh, her fall would be pricey enough. So, uh, yeah, hopefully that wins the 6.30. And the horse that I really like in the 7.30 Dundalk, uh, Liquid Lunch, 5 to 1 at the moment. I go a point each way on that. I think that's solid enough. Should be in the frame anyway. Uh, he's a horse that was bad. You know, he won two starts ago quite well. Last time out, he was drawn very poorly. The jockey was trying to get him settled. He was kind of a hostage to fortune, and it didn't go much of a gallop, and uh, he never really got into the race. But, uh, you know, stayed on steadily, and uh, I think tomorrow sets up really nice for him. He's drawn four there. He's, uh, you know, he should be he should be bang there to finish. He's four to one generally, but he is five to one the place. So, maybe, you know, point each way there. Uh, he shouldn't be too far away. And the first one will go a point win. Uh, obviously, as I said, I'll have one for the service uh, tomorrow as well. Brilliant, uh, you know, hit the front with the service this month. And, uh, you know, it's, hopefully now we just kick on and, you know, do what we usually do. But, you know, a nice confidence booster there today. And uh, more of the same tomorrow would be fantastic. Be nice now if them two won as well. Uh, heading, heading into the big race and this weekend at Leperstown. Really looking forward to it. If you haven't seen the podcast, myself and Paddy Dunn, we previewed the Dublin Racing Festival and uh, that went online there last night. Yeah. So, it's, uh, you know, we thought it went well. We got through a hell of a lot of the races and a good old discussion as usual. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, best of luck if you're following. Uh, don't forget the Patreon service. You know, it's still in its early days. Uh, massive result today, obviously. Uh, sets us up nicely now moving forward so uh, get involved you know and the link for the Patreon service is in the description below so get involved and best of luck if you're following and I'll talk to you tomorrow evening please God it's Joe Value for Cold Bear Sports thanks very much for listening and talk to you soon